everyone, I'm Alejandra from Alejandra.tv and in this video, I'm gonna share with you some new fun organizing products I found at the dollar store. Um, so if you are getting organized inside your house and you are looking for organizing products and you are, are looking for affordable ways to get organized, I hope you find this video helpful because everything I found at the dollar store was just a dollar and um, they're all fun ways to get organized. But first, if this is your first time watching any of my videos and you are just getting started with organizing or you are a new subscriber to my channel, you can check out my free video series on three tasks to do tonight uh, to wake up feeling more organized tomorrow morning. There's a link below. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so the first thing I found here at the dollar store were these very cool, cute, colorful little bins, just like that. They are stackable drawers. They look like they go on a desktop, but you can totally use them at, um, you know, on your countertop in the bathroom, under your cabinets in the bathroom again, under the kitchen for little, um, you know, just little things around your house that you wanna corral and get organized. All right, the next thing, there's a lot of things here. So the next thing were these really fun, colorful drawer organizers that come in hot pink. This is such a fun color. It's like neon pink, um, neon pink. It came in a bright yellow or like an orange. Um, it comes in green also, and then a blue as well. Now we are just getting started with organizing our house because we just moved and I popped one of these in, into Ed's drawer in his bathroom and it was like a perfect fit. I can't wait to show you guys the video to show you everything we did, but it fits so perfectly without any kind of putty. So these were fun. Again, they're great for any kind of drawer uh, where you wanna sort and categorize things. So along the same lines, I found these awesome, colorful little plastic bins. Just like that, they're just like those, but um, there, those are like translucent. These are solid colors. Again, for any kind of drawer you have around your house. Um, so they come in pink, they come in orange, they come in green, and they come in blue. I've only seen these in blue before. Like I see them every year in the blue, but I guess this year they have fun colors um, for spring. So a lot of these things were um, from their new like spring, spring fling, I think that's what they're calling it, spring fling release of new products. All right, next thing hangers so plastic hangers um if you are looking for fun hangers the dollar tree has them in orange they come in hot pink they come in like a turquoise color and then i think i also saw green um, so it's like the same colors as these ones here all right next thing was that this little dog treat container but just because it's for dog treats does not mean you only have to put dog treats inside you can put other things around your house use it in the garage for small hardware use it in the craft closet for craft supplies or use it anywhere where you are corralling things all right the next thing was this little tablet organizer tablet pouch you put your tablet inside your e-reader so it doesn't get damaged but just because it's for tablets does not mean you only have to use it for tablets you can totally use this for um, jewelry in your suitcase while you travel. You can use it for your passport, any other small things while you travel. You can use it in the car, like in your glove compartment. I feel like this is the perfect fit inside, you know, the little compartment for um, important documents. You can put wires and cords in here. Anything that you want protected because it's, you know, it's kind of like a padded, a padded envelope. And that came in pink, it came in light blue, it came in dark blue, and it came in red. All right, so this was a fun find. <laughs> this was a bright neon folder, but it's not just a folder. It's a folder inside with two pockets. You can put a little business card right here, but it also has a poly envelope on the outside for small pieces of paper, like, you know, receipts, coupons, stickers, anything that you cut out or something. Um, so it's just like a different kind of folder and it's such a fun color. All right, and that came in other colors as well. All right, this next thing, colorful tape for color coding things around your house. So it's PVC electrical tape, but this would be awesome for color coding all of your wires and cords behind your entertainment center, like behind the TV, behind your desk for, um, you know, like computer, printer, mouse, whatever you wanna color code with. Um, just wrap it around your cord, grab a permanent marker, label what it is, and then you know exactly what to unplug when you are unplugging something. All right, contact paper. So I love using contact paper in drawers, on the back of a bookcase, the back of a wall, or anything where you wanna add a pop of color without painting. So the dollar store had this new fun print. It's um, silver and white, and it's just a fun print. 
So that was a new color. And then they also had this new fun color. It's like, um, you know, it's like leaves. I don't know. It's like leaves, I guess, but it's a cushion contact paper. Um, and so you would put it at the bottom of a drawer. So I used, so again, we're organizing our entire house. So all these new systems are getting set up. So I used this in the bathroom, um, and in another place in the house and I use it as a noise barrier. So when you open a drawer and you put something down, it's not going to make this loud noise because it has this cushion at the bottom of the drawer. It has made a world of difference <laughs> in the bathroom drawers. So I will show that in a upcoming video. All right. The next thing I'm going to move kind of fast because there's a lot of things here. This is a magnetic little organizer that you can um, put on the side of the fridge or in the front of the fridge or on a magnetic strip in your office. And you can put push pins in here. You can put rubber bands in here, anything small that you want to keep contained. Next thing, this was really fun. So I have something just like this. It's a colorful, it's a colorful poly envelope. It's like a receipt organizer, or you can put your coupons in here sorted by category, but it's colorful. And, um, I've never seen this at the dollar store before. And I have this and I did not pay a dollar. <laughs> so this was so fun. It has seven different sections. You would just label all your sections, you know, parts and materials, computer expenses, whatever your categories are or whatever your coupons are. And then you can just close it up. You can label it on, label it on the outside with whatever you're storing inside, like coupon organizer, receipt organizer. So that was a totally fun find. <laughs> all right. The next thing, next thing. So I found more duct tape or more tape, but duct tape. Um, and I tried using it and it's super sticky. And I have to say, I tried using this as well and it's super sticky. It really sticks. There was another tape I found at the dollar store that was pretty, but it didn't stick. This sticks really well. And they have this, um, they have a bunch of new patterns. So this is like a bright colored paisley pattern. And then they have a, um, colorful Chevron pattern as well. So those are fun and you can use them as labels, um, like on the front of a shoe box, you can use them for hanging stuff or DIY projects. You can use them for all sorts of things. All right. Then I found these little label holders and I can't remember if I showed these, I think I showed these like two years ago or something, but they're label holders. You can label binders, you can label baskets. Um, you can label bins, you can label anything that needs a label. It's like a little laminated label and you just pop a label in there and it's nice and laminated and it won't peel off. All right. The next thing. All right. So I love using mini binders for, um, I use the same binder as my coupon binder. I did a video on it a couple years ago. It's awesome. Mini binders are great. Um, they are hard to find inserts because they are so small. The dollar store had mini binder dividers just like this. Never seen them before. They have a nice pocket right here for smaller pieces of paper and um, they come three to a pack. Now, if you need six dividers or you need more dividers, what you can do is you can get two packs and you can just take the divider and you kind of have to do this like this. You can flip it upside down and put it in upside down and you can create a divider that's down here. So if you do that with a second pack, flip them all upside down, you now have six dividers that are all lined up. You just can't use the pocket because it's upside down. Well, I guess you could, you just have to paper clip whatever you want to store inside the upside down pocket, but how fun, sturdy, um, they're fun colors. And that was just a fun find. All right, let's move along. Next thing. Um, so part of their like spring fling new products and new colors that came out was this fun coral color. Um, I feel like I'm really into coral lately and this is just such a fun bin. It's a different size bin. It's not like your typical shoe size box, shoe size. Yeah. Shoe box. Um, it's a little bit smaller and wider. So this is fun, has fun, like floral print on the outside. And that comes in pink. It comes in this fun green right here. This is a letter tray. Um, the same thing comes in pink, coral, green, and this color. And now if you want to like stack letter trays together, you could, um, use mounting putty or museum putty to stick them together so they don't move and then stick this to the desk. So it doesn't move. 
I have this thing about organizing products that move. All right, so this next thing is a cord organizer for a dollar. <laughs> so it's a cord organizer that goes on your desk or on an entertainment center, wherever there's cords and wires that you're gonna unplug and you don't want the wire or cord to fall behind the piece of furniture. So it was a dollar and I tried testing it out to see if it really worked and here you go, here is my test. So I put it on a piece of wood, the adhesive did not stick. And I read this online that the adhesive is not very good. So I took the adhesive off and added my own double-sided sticky mounting tape and it works perfectly now. It's so secure to this piece of wood. And now if I unplug this wire and I just pop it into this holder right here, the wire is not gonna, um, it's not gonna fall behind whatever furniture. I'm, you know, I have the wire on or behind or something. But anyways, this was a dollar. If you go on Amazon, it's like 16 bucks plus $7 shipping. It's crazy. So <laughs> that was just like a really fun find. And I just found that in like some random aisle. It was misplaced and I think it was like the last one. All right, for the very first time, I saw command strips at the dollar store. They had two small ones, two to a pack for small ones, and then one to a pack for large ones. And I looked, I was comparing the price to see if this was a good deal. And um, it seems like it's like the same deal at Walmart and um, the same deal online. So it's not really a better deal, but if you're at the dollar store and you need a command strip, some Dollar Trees have them. All right, the next thing was fabric tape. So I only found this at one dollar store. It's, um, it's fabric tape, I guess you use it for fabric, but I used this um, in the bathroom for organizing something, which I'll show you in an upcoming video. It works great, it is so sticky, it doesn't peel, it's actually hard to peel off, um, and it comes in fun, cute patterns. So I will show you that when we get to the bathroom. All right, and then they also had a washi tape that was Scotch brand. Um, I have Scotch brand washi tape, a bigger roll, and it sticks so well, it's easy to peel off, and it comes in fun um, patterns and colors. All right, so this next thing is a, um, it's like a cake pan, lasagna pan <laughs> that I saw at the dollar store and it comes in colors. Like the top is a color, the top is purple, it also comes in pink. And I saw it and I was like, you could totally do this for sorting papers or for, um, for craft supplies or for something light because these things aren't very sturdy. But for some reason, when you put the top on the bottom, it becomes like super sturdy. So um, anyways, this comes in purple and pink. If you don't want to use it as a cake pan, you could totally use it for papers anything light and everything else I just mentioned. All right, and the last thing I found was this garlic wine vinegar. So out of everything that I found at the dollar store, this was actually one of my favorite things that I found. And I'm not gonna share with you what I did with this just yet, but it has to do with getting organized. I'm gonna share with you in an upcoming video a cool way to use this. So I hope you found this video helpful. I hope it gave you a lot of ideas on creative ways to get organized, but also get organized um, on a budget and not go crazy spending a lot of money. If this is your first time watching any of my videos, you can subscribe for more tips and videos on getting organized, or you can check out my website, alahundra.tv for more tips, tools, and training on living a more organized and productive life. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.